Hey, what's up guys, Z here, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at the HP Envy 15T Touch laptop. So this laptop is currently on sale for $649.99. Now, if you were buying this laptop for a gaming as a gaming laptop, then I would not recommend this just because it has the Intel HD Graphics 620. Now, in order to in order for a laptop to be a gaming laptop, it needs to it needs to have a powerful video card. This laptop does not have a powerful video card. It has an integrated video card. So it's not powerful in terms of video graphics, but otherwise, if you're looking for more of a media PC, a fast media PC, then this would be it, especially because it has the NVMe and it has the Core i7 in there. It's got eight gigabytes of RAM. So those are the main points of why this would be a very fast media laptop. But again, it's not a gaming laptop. So let's go over the specs really quickly. I just want to go over the specs with you guys. So it has the seventh generation Intel Core i7 processor. Now, this, now if we go ahead and click on the spec sheet, we can see here that this Core i7 7500U isn't underpowered. It's a lower, it consumes less battery, but, again, but it is also a less powerful CPU. So usually in the Core i7s you do have, in the mobile Core i7s you do have six megabytes of cache and you do have four cores. Now this Core i7, again, is an underpowered and a good way to actually see if it's an underpowered processor is, this is what I like to do, I like to see what the, what the letter is after the number. So this one right here, this has a U. I always think of it as underpowered, I don't know why, I just think 7500U underpowered, okay. And I just look away. But in terms of this laptop, because it's not a gaming laptop, and it's more of a very fast media laptop, 7500U is actually a good pick for this laptop just because it does have a three cell battery. If we go down here, we, see, we can see right here it has a three cell 52WHR lithium ion battery. So that battery is not, it's a, it's a pretty small battery. You won't get a lot of battery uh, time using this laptop. It does say up to seven hours, seven hours, but I would, I, I see this thing not lasting more than say two and a half, three hours, and that is my guesstimate. But overall, this is a fast media PC if you're looking for a media PC. If you're looking for a gaming PC, then I would look into a different laptop. So if we go further down here, it does have eight gigabytes of DDR4 RAM, so that is pretty decent RAM, that is fast RAM. And if we go over to the hard drive, which is the storage space, we can see here that it does have the 256 gigabytes PCIe NVMe. So that is the latest and greatest. That is a very fast hard drive. It's a smaller format hard drive. So you could have two hard drives in this laptop, which does make it a good media PC to store a bunch of movies, data, different things on there. So going further down here, again, we do have the three cell 52 hour battery and just going lower we do see the weight of 4.8 pounds so that is a little bit on the heavier side but that is most probably because of the specs the specs are pretty good on this so guys again that is not a gaming laptop this is a media laptop a very fast media laptop at that so that is going to be it for this video if you did find this video helpful give me a thumbs up if you have any comments leave it in the comment section below if you were looking for a gaming laptop if you did want to ask me a question of which gaming laptop would I re recommend for you guys? If you guys did have any questions like that, leave it in the comment section below. Thanks for watching, and until next time, I'll catch you on the flip side.